We've been living in Bentfleet all our lives. Oliver was born in South End, and it's a lovely community, a lovely little village, and we're very happy here. Oliver is a really cheeky chappy. He's got a great personality, and he's got a sister that adores him. Oliver needs to be cared for 24 hours a day. I have to feed him because he's got really severe ataxia, which means he can't hold a knife and fork like you and I. I have to dress him because he is just immobile and he can't dress himself. Where you care for a baby, it's just carried on over the years and that's the way it is. But he's totally understanding of it and he's very, very helpful. We're going to play our next game now. Oh, I've lived here all my life and Glenwood's been built ever since I can remember. Oliver's now 16 and a half. Um, he's been going to Glenwood since he was three and a half. And the teachers and the staff there are absolutely fantastic. Just the pure understanding of how these children's needs are met on a daily basis. They're just so understanding. Every night he comes home and tells me what he's been doing and absolutely adores it. Well done, well done. At Glenwood, we want to get our young people ready for the most independent and happy future that they can have. Everything we teach them needs to be purposeful. We always say that the curriculum that we teach is the young people themselves. When we found out we were actually getting the new build, we were all so excited and just thought about the new opportunities it would give our young people and their families. We were lucky that the build was taking place just next door, so the young people were able to look through the fence and see it being built. For our more able young people who would actually be able to learn from the process, they were able to do regular visits and see the school as it was being built. So they understood that it was our new school going up. As staff, we were fearful that we might not be able to keep the feel of Glenwood while moving into such a big building. Morgan Sindel were fabulous in becoming part of Glenwood. When you walked round and when you walked in, you could feel that they did have a real passion. They became a part of Glenwood as they worked. The young people are thrilled with the new build. It feels very warm, very friendly. It's a very happy place to be. We hadn't envisaged that it would be on such a grand scale and as amazing as it's turned out to be. And it's really lovely for us to see them finding the same excitement that we found when we went round. We wanted greater opportunities for our young people moving into the new build. Morgan Cinder, they really listened to the feedback they heard from us, but also that getting to know our young people, they understood the importance of the building and how much difference it was going to make to their lives and the opportunities that they would have. We couldn't wait for it to be finished. It looks so modern and so light and airy with big windows and lots and lots of glass. I think it's phenomenal. Every day Oliver feels that he's going into a new adventure going there because there's new things going on all the time and I think it's going to make a lot of difference to the choices that we're going to make as to where he's going to go in the next few years. For me as a mum, I just feel 100% relaxed and happy that he's been really well looked after and his education is fulfilled.